it's important for us to constantly ask Allah's forgiveness every day. One of the most blessed times that you could actually call out to Allah is the time of suhoor. That is a time, the last third of the night, the time of tahajjud, the time just before the fajr adhan uh, is called. And at this particular time, the hadith says, يَنزِلُ اللَّهُ تَبَارَكَ وَتَعَالَى إِلَى السَّمَاءِ الدُّنْيَا كُلَّ لَيْلَةٍ حِينَ يَبْقَى ثُلُثُ اللَّيْلِ الْأَخِيرِ فَيَقُولُ هَلْ مِنْ تَائِبٍ فَأَتُوبَ عَلَيْهِ وَهَلْ مِنْ مُسْتَغْفِرٍ فَأَغْفِرَ لَهِ وَهَلْ مِنْ سَائِلٍ فَأُعْطِيَهُ Allah Almighty descends to the lowest heavens in a manner that is befitting His majesty. And He calls out when the last third of the night remains, he calls out saying, is there anyone seeking forgiveness that I may forgive him? Is there anyone who is repenting that I can accept the repentance? And is there anyone asking me anything that I can give them? Now, the good thing about Ramadan is we're mostly awake at the time for suhoor in order to eat the pre-fast meal. And at that time, we don't realize that actually we should be also seizing the opportunity to do two more things. Number one is to call out to Allah with your needs because Allah is calling out at that time. Answer Allah to say, yes, I am the one who needs. I am the one who's repenting. I'm the one who's seeking forgiveness. That would definitely be a bonus. And together with that, the second thing is, it is the time of tahajjud, which is the best prayer after the farad prayer and the witr. This is the best in terms of the voluntary prayers. And the Prophet ﷺ used to read it quite regularly. If you were to look at what you can do to earn the pleasure of Allah, he mentions in the Quran, in Surah As-Sajda, تَتَجَافَ جُنُوبُهُمْ عَنِ الْمَضَاجِعِ يَدْعُونَ رَبَّهُمْ خَوْفًا وَطَمَعًا وَمِمَّا رَزَقْنَاهُمْ يُنْفِقُونَ Allah speaks of those men and those people who liven up their homes with the remembrance of Allah and those whom Allah loves. One of their qualities is their sides forsake their beddings at night. Uh, they call out to Allah with hope and with fear, fearing his punishment and hoping in his mercy. And they spend a lot from what Allah has given them. They spend in good causes. They look after people. They take care of the needs of others, financial and monetary. And Allah takes care of them.